We had further disappointing news on the labor front with a report that was issued today on nationwide job creation. Only 36,000 jobs were created, and whereas the unemployment rate fell to 9%, those 36,000 jobs was far below what was expected by economists. They were expecting the U.S. to create somewhere between 150 and 170,000 net new jobs. Whereas we're seeing good reports from other groups, such as the Institute of Supply Management surveys that track both manufacturing and non-manufacturing, which were both extremely positive for January, and we're also hearing from groups that track corporate layoffs that those are down compared to what we've seen. This is yet to translate into solid job performance, and that is the critical thing for the economy. And it's particularly important for a state like Connecticut, which only added 5,300 jobs in all of 2010, and actually in the last month of 2010, lost 4,300 jobs.